How's it going guys, Fidel here again, and today I have a well-rounded squad for you guys. So I go through the divisions with various teams. This one, the reason why I created it is because most players with well-rounded stats are absolutely amazing and OP. Like David Luiz for example. So basically what I did was forfeit a couple of matches so I can get into Division 2 and show you guys the, my, my teams more effectively and get more goals for you guys. So if you don't know what I mean by well-rounded, what I mean is that they can do all things at a decent caliber. So here's the team guys, the defense is strong, the attack is strong. And basically it's in a very strong formation of 4-5-1. I won't be showing you the stats now, but at the end of the video I'll show you each player and their stats. So for our first Division 2 team, we are coming up against a very strong EPL team at the back. And it has some nice League 1 players up the front. So as soon as I got into the match guys, I realised that the centre backs were quite slow on 72 pace and 68 pace. However, they did have quite good uh, defensive work rates and that is medium and high. What I did like about the team guys is that the midfield had absolutely amazing passing and Jovati was quite fast and could get past the defenders as he's got a very very high strength also he's got 76 heading and that is great for a striker I don't know how he just got two crosses to him and he put them both away guys that puts us on three points and we are pushing on to the next team coming up against a 4-5-1 solid BPO squad however as soon as we got in Jovetic does an amazing long shot and that goes in giving us 1-0 at 19th minute Jovetic is absolutely fantastic guys he's so good for a tall striker with 87 dribbling. One thing I really really disliked about this team guys was that they were decent in every aspect however they didn't exceed in any. That really made it hard to play for the team. For example Hemsik was not fast enough to be one of the three main strikers as he had 75 pace. Also a lot of players did lack agility and that was a main aspect that was really letting the team down guys. I really hate players with low agility as it's very hard to play with them and it makes the whole team feel sluggish. On the other hand it was absolutely amazing when all the players had decent stats and that made it easy to get goals with Jovetic at the front. They were basically feeding him every single ball and when you have a team that has great creator rating that means that you will have more goals and more chances. So here's the team again guys and I'll show you the stats of every single player right there Now you can see that all the players have just around the same amount of stats However, the left and right back were a bit more pacier than their other stats So the keeper was not taken into consideration as he does not have well-rounded stats also guys there was no OP players in this team however I did find a player of the team and that was Asamoa he was an absolutely amazing player guys he's so fast he's so strengthy he's got 86 strength and 86 aggression and he felt so much faster than 83 pace guys he's got a great shot on him and he is 184 centimeters tall guys. He's also got a centimeter card and a left back inform card if you would want to pick that one up. On top of that guys, he's only 1k guys. So please remember to like, comment and subscribe and see you next time. <laughs>